In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys the best way to farm credits in Combat Warriors so you guys could unlock the Dragon Slayer or the Chainsaw. As you guys can see right now, I have every single heavy weapon in the game and I also have every single light weapon in the game. So I obviously know what I'm talking about, all right? So make sure you guys go ahead and stick by and watch the video all the way to the end because I'm going to be explaining the best methods to grind credits today. And we're going to cut all the trash, we're going to cut all the garbage and get straight right into this. Alright, so before we get into these tips and stuff, make sure you guys are in the right server. So click the server list and go ahead and click on standard, assuming that you're higher than level 15. And you want to go ahead and join a server that is between 20 to 30 players. You don't want to go too high, because in too high servers, you're going to see a lot of people spamming like nukes and missile showers. And you don't want to go too low because you can't find anybody. So a fair amount is between 20 to 30. That is the best to grind in. So make sure you guys join that, alright? Alright, so the first tip is make use of your utility. You always want to make sure that you're using your C4s, your kunais, your molotovs, your grenades, whatever you have, you always want to be using your utility because it's free kills, alright? So oftentimes when you're playing this game, you're going to see a lot of people just chilling around in big groups and stuff like that. Like that is the best time to use your utility. Like whether you have like grenades or C4s or whatever you have, you just want to chuck them at them, bro. Like you always want to use your utility. It's free kills, free money. Like bro, people sleep on utility. Trust me guys, you want to use your utility as much as possible. It's a very, it's very... Alright, so for example, in my situation right here, I'm just gonna go ahead and throw my C4 since there's a lot of people around in the same area. And there you go, I got one of them. So uh, the best utilities, I would say, in terms of killing people and getting the most money out of it is probably kunais, C4s, and either bandages or a frag grenade, alright? So I think those are the best utilities you guys could have in this game. And bro, like I said, bro, utilities are so important, bro. They give you so many free kills, especially when everybody's just grouped up together and fighting. Utility is very important if you want to make money, bro. Utility. Alright, so the next tip I have is don't be afraid to third party or don't be afraid to fight people with better weapons than you, alright? Like, bro, this game, you gotta be down bad. And by down bad, I mean you have to steal kills. You have to third party. You have to fight people, bro. Like, I see a lot of people being scared to do these things, but, like, that's the way you make money, bro. Like, a lot of people complain about third parties in this game and say people don't respect 1v1s anymore, but that's just kind of what happens over time in PvP games like this. People start to not care about respect for 1v1s and stuff, alright? So, like, if you actually want to rank up and get better and get money to get better weapons, you just have to start, like, riding the wave like everybody else is, bro. You gotta go ahead and third party, and, um, but yeah, bro, he's just gotta be down bad. Like, if you see somebody, like, glory killing, you gotta get in there, steal that glory kill, maybe get both of them. If you see somebody down, throw the kunais at them. Like, you gotta be down bad, bro. Like, we're here to make money. Money. we're here to get credits we're here to get the dragon slayer you just gotta do it bro like personally what i do is i fight anybody in my path bro like whether they have a dragon slayer or a chainsaw like i just fight everybody even if i don't kill them like it still doesn't matter because i'm still getting assist i'm still getting xp and i'm still getting money regardless like if you want to maximize your money bro you could just you just got to keep fighting everybody like regardless like if you want to chill trust me get the dragon slayer or the chainsaw first and you could chill afterwards bro but like in the meantime you want to you want to grind bro you want to grind you want to kill everybody in your way and you just want to you just want to get money bro like that's 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 a all right look at this guys this ties back in with the utility thing all right look look what look at that bro all right, so try to use finish kills and glory kills whenever you can. I know a lot of people don't like waiting for the super long animations and would rather just finish them off normally. But trust me, guys, all right? Like, I know it gives a little bit of money, but over time, they add up. They add up, bro. People sleep on finish kills and glory kills. Um, but trust me, bro, like, whenever you have the chance to, like, get a free glory kill in or a free finish kill in, just do it. Like, I know it doesn't give that much money, but, bro, like, the more you do it, it just adds up, like... I know you can't you can't always be finished killing and glory killing because like people might steal your kills but trust me guys if there's nobody around you just just glory kill just finish kill dude like it's not that hard it just takes a couple seconds and it gives you free money if you want to maximize your money and make money as fast as possible bro like this is this is the way man this is the way as you guys saw i just wiped out like that whole area right there i got some finish kills i couldn't get all of them but i got some and that's what's important bro and if you notice, all these tips I'm giving you guys, they connect back to each other. Like, look at this. I'm getting free kills with all of my utilities. I'm getting free kills and free money with, like, with my finished kills. Like, I'm doing everything, bro. Like, if you do what I'm doing right here and just using all of these tips and putting them all to use, you're gonna get the Dragon Slayer in no time, bro. Okay, so here's another small tip. Open up settings, and you guys should see this option right here that says slash reset delay. Make sure you guys go ahead and change this to zero. So this basically means that every time you swing, it's always your first swing animation that comes out. And this has the best hitbox, all right? So if you guys want to maximize your hitbox and uh, just be, like, hitting better shots, make sure you put this to zero, all right? So that's another small tip. Something I noticed when playing this game is people tend to, like, parry early and, like, panic parry, basically. So basically, whenever you... Look, look, that, bro, he just did it. You see, like, 
people get scared and they parry like way too early and whenever they parry early they get stunned for a second or two and whenever that happens you guys always want to go ahead and like rush in and be aggressive bro because like when you parry and you miss your parry you're stunned for like a second or two and whenever people are stunned you just want to go ahead like it's a free hit bro like you probably kill them and like finish them off whenever they miss a parry so like it's very important like make sure you like you don't get scared and like parry too early or you bait other people's parries okay this guy's literally cosplaying as ramen what what is that that's my first time ever seeing somebody cosplay as like ramen <laughs> all right but uh yeah back to what i was saying like you don't want to panic parry and um a lot of people do panic parry and you want to take advantage of that and um whenever they do that bro just get it go in there get some free hits in because they're stunned for a second or two don't be scared pull out your weapon and a lot of people are, will parry right away bro like they parry out of fear so that, that that's pretty good bro all right so uh yeah i have a little hostage here now all right we have a bacon hostage Okay, this goes back to rule one. There's no mercy. No mercy, bro. Alright, we gotta kill. There's no friendliness. Alright, we gotta kill this guy. I'm sorry, Bacon. Uh, but in the cold world of grinding. But yeah, honestly, like adding on to what I was saying earlier, you always want to be aggressive and push people. Um, a lot of times when you do push people, they panic parry and they mess up. And that's a free chance for you to go ahead and kill them. And whenever you do kill somebody, you get money, bro. Like, trust me, bro. You always want to play aggressive. The more aggressive you play, the more people, like, panic parry. And the more free kills, like, opportunities that come, bro. So, like, make sure you guys always play properly. Have an open eye. Make sure you guys don't, like, waste your parries and time your parries correctly. And honestly, yeah, bro. It just takes practice. The more you play, the more you get better at this stuff. All right, and the last tip I have for you guys, it's not really a tip. But I just want to go ahead and share a few words of wisdom, all right? Um, yeah, you guys gotta understand that you cannot unlock the Dragon Slayer or the Chainsaw overnight. Like, unless you're Bill Gates' son or something and just buy the whole game, it's not gonna happen, alright? Um, but yeah, seriously guys, like, a lot of people get demotivated because it takes a while to grind and actually unlock the Dragon Slayer or the Chainsaw, but trust me, bro, like, it's all a part of the plan, bro. It's all a part of the journey. My biggest tip is probably just, like, staying consistent, man. Just having fun with it, playing the game, staying consistent. Okay, what is this, bro? I just lost my train of thought because I saw this- Bro, what- <laughs> what is, what is this man what's going on okay yeah he just left okay but yeah bro i could guarantee if you guys put all of these tips to use you could unlock both the dragon slayer and the chainsaw it just takes some time bro honestly everything does take some time and i'll uh, make sure you guys go ahead and put these tips to use so like make sure you guys always go ahead and make use of all of your utility make sure you guys attack big crowds of people make sure you third party everybody third parties in this game make sure you third party as well all right uh yeah so make sure you guys put all these tips to use i could guarantee it will help you it will help you like grind the fastest towards your dragon slayer or chainsaw goal and um yeah bro if you guys have enjoyed this video and found it helpful subscribe like and i'll see you guys on the next one